during Women's History Month, we remember humanitarian Lillian Ward, one of the most influential social reformers of all time. She pioneered programs including free school lunches. And as CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports, she also founded a New York City settlement that continues to thrive and expand. Henry Street Settlement, from 1893 until now, has delivered to Lower East Side residents health care, social services, and lessons in everything from language to music. Its founder, Lillian Wald, lived from 1867 until 1940. Yes, we have a photo of her when she was in her early 20s. And this is a photo of her graduation from nursing school here in New York City. Katie Vogel is public historian for the settlement, sharing with us details of Wald's remarkable life. Wald's parents were immigrants from Eastern Europe, and she was raised in Rochester with wealth and privilege. Nursing is what brought her to a poverty-stricken Lower East Side, where she made house calls, saved lives, and over the course of more than four decades, changed New York City for the better, and not just in terms of health care. She was a public health nurse, but she was also an immigrants' rights activist. She was a labor activist. She was a co-founder of the NAACP. She was affecting change, but she couldn't even vote. People started to hear about her activism work from really all over the world. And so activists who were involved in public health and social reform and racial justice came here to Henry Street to talk to Lillian Wald. Wald believed children should have organized clean places to play instead of the city streets. In 1899, she co-founded a league that resulted in Seward Park here on the Lower East Side. It is recognized as the first permanent municipal playground in the nation. She also brought reforms to the city's public schools. Free school lunch programs, special education classes in public schools, school nurses. She is right here in the center. These are people she called her family. She was a queer person. She wouldn't have used a term like that in the 1890s or early 1900s, but we have love letters between her and a few women. In the 130 years since Wald founded this place and made it her home, it has grown to 18 different sites with a total of 60 programs. David Garza is Henry Street Settlement's president and CEO. And the things that she cared about are the things that we care about now, equity, access, inclusion, fairness, opportunity, and service. Garza says Wald gave us a blueprint that endures and that the Wald way begins with treating everyone with dignity, respect, and care. On the Lower East Side, Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News. For more stories on Women's History Month, head to our website, cbsnewyork.com.